LaptopKey.com, your source for replacement keyboard keys. Notice, many times, laptop manufacturers produce keyboards that look the same on the outside, but have different retainer clips underneath the keys. To help you find the correct repair video for your keyboard, we've created a searchable database. Simply go to LaptopKey.com, enter your laptop brand and model number, scroll down to the bottom of the page and click on View Videos. A list of all compatible videos will appear. Select the retainer clip model that matches your keyboard. That's all, you're now ready to repair your laptop keyboard. For this keyboard, we will be showing the removal and reattachment of the J key for standard size keys, Enter for the wide set keys, and F9 for the top row small keys. To remove your standard size keys, simply insert your tool under the upper right corner, apply gentle upward pressure, and the key cap will remove itself. To remove the retainer clip, support the bottom of the clip with your finger, insert a tool under the upper right and left corners, gentle upward pressure, and they're removed. To reassemble your clips, we'll begin with the top clip, which has two small square holes at the top and two thin rectangular holes at the bottom. For the bottom clip, there's an upward facing notch at the top alongside the rounded edge of the interior. Simply insert the two halves together using the holes on the bottom for the arms on the top then using the metal arms here and here, you will lay the clip down, hooking onto those hooks, pressing down flat, then replacing your keycap with a firm press, and we're functional. To remove the wider set keys, insert your tool into this side of the key, run up and down until you hear a click, then continue to run along the outside edge of the key to disconnect from the metal support arms. Then insert under the upper right corner, and apply gentle upward pressure, repeat from the upper left until you're disconnected. To remove the key supports, simply lift the metal arms one side and the other, then repeat with the opposite arm. To remove the retainer clips, support the bottom of the clip with your finger, insert a tool under the upper right and left corners, apply gentle upward pressure until the clip is removed. To reassemble your clips, We'll begin with the top clip, which has two holes at the top alongside a rounded edge, as well on the bottom clip with two holes and the larger edge of the interior at the top. Simply line up the two halves, insert the arms of the top into the holes on the bottom. Then using a metal hook here at the bottom, you will lay the clip down flat ensuring the hook is on the outer edge of the clip. Press down the metal hooks at the top. To reattach the metal arms, you will use holes here, 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 and here, using the top set of holes for the top arm, which you will lay down flat, then repeat with the bottom arm using the bottom set of holes. Also lay that down flat. Then take your keycap, place on top of everything, presses around the edge, and we're reattached. For removal of the top row keys, insert your tool under the upper right corner, gentle upward pressure, and the cap is removed. To remove the retention clip, support the bottom of the clip with your finger, insert your tool under the top right and left corners, gentle upward pressure, and the clip is removed. To reassemble your clips, 
We'll begin with the top clip, which has two arms in the middle with the actual connector piece being slightly more towards the bottom of the clip. For the bottom clip, there are two holes as well as a small rounded notch at the top. Then simply line the two up, connect together, inserting the arms of the top clip into the holes on the bottom. Then using the metal hooks here and here, you will lay the clip down bottom first, hook on, a firm press to the top, replace your keycap, firm press, and we're functional. Simply pull on the edge of the key in a gentle but firm motion. Lift up and remove the key. It's that simple. If your key is loose and not sticking properly to your keyboard, your retainer clips are likely broken. This issue can be fixed by replacing your retainer clips. Replacement laptop keys and retainer clips can be purchased at LaptopKey.com. LaptopKey.com, your source for replacement keyboard keys.